In this video, I'm going to show you how you can troubleshoot gas problem when you try to deploy your SafeMoon fork. So, in the previous video, when I deployed the SafeMoon fork, I've made an error because there was some code that was commented out, but and that wasn't supposed to be commented out. Oh, let me go to the constructor. So I uncommented the code and I redeployed the token, but I had some problem with gas because Truffle wasn't able to estimate the gas necessary for the deployment. And that's because there is this inner transaction that makes things a little bit more complicated. So in order to solve this problem, what I did is I basically copy pasted the whole code of the token. Then I went to Remix, which is an online code editor for Solidity, the programming language of smart contract. Then I created a new smart contract, which I call safemoonfork.sol. Then I pasted the code from GitHub. Then here, I just made sure it was the same Solidity version. Then I went to MetaMask. I made sure I was on Binance Smart Chain mainnet. I selected the correct account where I have enough BNB for the deployment. So when you change your account in MetaMask, you may have to reload Remix. Then I went to the deployment tab. I went to Injected Web3. Oh yeah, so it's actually at this moment that it might prompt you to connect MetaMask to Remix. Then I made sure here that the correct amount was correct account was selected. I selected the contract to save moon fork and we need to pass as an argument to the constructor the address of the router contract of PancakeSwap. So I went back to GitHub in the repo of fork safe moon. I went into migrations, deploy contracts and here we're going to select this address that's for PancakeSwap router v2 then back to remix we paste this address then here let's click on deploy and here we can see the correct gas limit estimation from remix so we copy this we reject the transaction and back in github and I'll go in fork safe moon truffle config and we scroll down and so basically I pasted the gas estimation from remix here and I added a parameter gas it actually means gas limit so with this we basically force truffle to use this parameter for gas limit and I run the deployment again and this time it worked so just to be clear you don't have to change anything in your code I'll just show you how I solve a gas problem and you can use the same technique if you have gas problem for your deployment in the future. 